Today, open cages are on the streets of London to ask the people one simple question. What if a five-year-old child weighed 300 pounds? You're asking me if a child, if I'm asking a child to weigh 300 pounds? It's, um, yeah, you can't do that. I think I'd be quite wrong. It's, yeah, horrendous. Um, major health problems. Something would happen to their limbs, definitely. I mean, they're, they're small. Painful life. If you were that heavy, yeah, it, you'd be immobile and your bone structure, everything would just be ruined. Well, they might grow up to be deformed, you never know. Um, heart problems, definitely. They're not in that physical shape to carry 300 pounds, so it's just impossible for them. And it would be heartless for a person to force them to do that. Why would that be a problem? Well, it's, it's not his choice. This is footage from a chicken farm. Right. And what they do on these farms is they use a specific breed of chicken mm. that grows very, very quickly. If a human was growing as quickly as these chickens, right. a five-year-old child would weigh 300 pounds. Oh, my days. That's horrendous. Kind of disgusting. So everything you were saying, mm. leg problems, deformities, yeah. heart problems. I see that, yeah. So we're outside Tesco today because right. this is something that Tesco is fully aware of. All cheap chicken comes from breeds like this. I definitely didn't expect Tesco to, to have a part in that. Especially as one of the UK's you know, largest brands, I thought they'd have quite a big um, responsibility, but obviously not. They yeah, should do something to fix it. So if M&S and Waitrose can have programs, then I'm sure Tesco can as well. But they've lost the customer if, if, that's, if that's what's going on behind the scenes. Chicken from Tesco's, if they're doing that, I would never touch it again, I'm telling you. Never.